Essentially, we're going to try to make two topiaries today. Um, the topiaries are basically fused together. I'm thinking like grapes, bananas, pears, peaches, and maybe we'll make like a melon for the bottom. Or I was also thinking maybe I'll make a quick dead bird or something that goes kind of on the bottom of the piece. So we'll, we'll build this piece. Just for your information, we're going to be using an oxyacetylene that may, in fact, like scorch the glass in places, and I'm totally okay with that. I think that's awesome. All right, let's try this. Um, head, head towards the, uh, yes, thank you. Urban Glass was founded in 1977. We serve all of the creative community, artists who work primarily in glass, and also artists who have never worked in glass before. Beth Lippman came to Urban Glass in the late 1990s. I think she was here for about four years. She started out as a teaching assistant, eventually became a teacher herself, and then went on to become the director of education. So I always, until very recently, had a job as an arts administrator. That really fulfilled this need of being involved in community and, and coming together with a community to get something done. And that's very similar to working in glass, working in hot glass. You need a lot of people sometimes to make things that you can't make on your own. And that's really a humbling experience, really wonderful. Ooh, that's nice. So Leo, I'm going to um, shape after this. Okay. 